Hello, Internet Universe. We're playing uh, Sushi Soul Universe. I was very happy to see that this has an English version. And I gotta turn down the volume of my headphones because it's very loud. Um, I don't know if this is a sequel to I Feet Two Sure I'll Die or if it's like a remake or what. All I know is it's always on sale on the Japanese eShop and I was like, uh, but I don't have any yen in my Japanese account right now. And thankfully, there is an English version. I want to find out how bad the translation's gonna be, so let's just jump in. Uh, language, English, yes. I don't think that changed anything. Cool. We got more settings? Right stick sensitivity. Stick invert. Button for quick landing. We can change the difficulty, but I don't know what difficulty is on to start with, so we're just going to leave it on whatever it starts with. And hope it's not too hard. Yeah, I got nothing else to say. Let's do it. Oh, never mind. Uh, difficulty means the speed at which the life gauge increases, how easily you die changes. In easy mode, handy checkpoints enough throughout the course. There's no difference in the story or skills you can acquire based on difficulty. So, if we don't eat sushi, we die. So I guess that our life gauge decreases as long as we're not eating sushi. Let's go with normal, because I am not a true gamer, so I'm not going to do difficult on my first try. Anytime now, man. Wow, there's some resolution in this game. Oh, we can, like, dive after we jump. We don't get a double jump. View move. And then that'll reset. The sushi of this city is good quality, huh? Let's find sushi and eat it. Uh, where's more sushi? That looks like sushi, kind of. But it's just a bench? Jump platform is my first time seeing one. The square things look like sushi are bounce pads. Here we go. Love of sushi. Your love of sushi is so strong that you'll die if you stop eating it. Your life gauge decreases with time. Keep eating sushi to prevent it from reaching zero. Let's eat sushi. Where's sushi? There's sushi. So once it fills up, it like doesn't give us any. Doesn't give us any like real buffer or anything. So we only get to eat 15 pieces? Actually, 15 pieces is kind of a lot of sushi. I would like to have 15 pieces of sushi right now. Uh, what? What? That's weird. It's a sushi fairy! Don't know why it's not a little! With the power strong and twist the fate of the universe, this enemy seems to be ridiculously powerful. Time to turn your willpower to strength. Save the concept of sushi in this universe with your passion.
that's a great place to just freeze. Please tell me the game didn't crash. Thank you, Sushi Lover, for your courageous decision. We need to put Sushi Souls to clear away the darkness. It's clip art! It's an Austria clip art! We're just using it as the clip out clip art. Oh my god! Clear the trial beyond the gate to earn sushi souls. Collect lots of sushi souls to overcome the grand sushi trial. Let's collect sushi soul. Number gates will open when you collect sushi souls. So it's like Banjo Kazooie, I guess. Cool. Here we go. Yatte <laughs> yaruze. I see, it, it all saves. Great. Hey, Vopker. I don't know if this guy has a name, but yeah, let's call him Sushi Man. Brace yourselves for an epic sushi adventure. Sushi at the familiar restaurants. Clear condition, eat a lot of sushi. It's time to eat sushi, or I'll die! We're just going with the clipper. Oh no! I got launched! Oh, and we're doing the, uh... We're doing the, uh... Katamari. Damashi. You know, overdone joke of... We're gonna make all this really, like, earnest music. Oh no, we're gonna die! <laughs> he explodes. He explodes if he doesn't get sushi. Okay, we're gonna avoid that thingy that launched me last time. Oh, you got that Okay, we got our 20 pieces of sushi. New record of 29 seconds. Keep going like that. The store is now open. Shop with Gari you get from clearing courses or dying. In the store, you can buy skills to enhance your actions. Gari equals money equals sushi garnish. Skill. There are many types. I don't have them. Portable tornado. Creates a healing spot that covers your life gauge. You can be used once per course. Take it easy. Look around. Eat sushi without rushing. Change direction to midair or move more three dimensionally through the course. Well, we can't buy any of these yet. So sorry, little shrimp sushi. We're not buying your stuff yet. It's a cotton candy stand, but it's not selling cotton candy. Okay. So we cleared that one already, right? The goal, seen in the distance. It's also in the giant conveyor belt sushi. Cool, we're still using the uh, clip art. Why did it launch me to the side? Like, the arrow looks like it's pointing forward, right? Oh, 
This is just some crazy dialogue. Oh, so it's not about getting the right number of sushi this time, it's about just getting to the bowl. Tabata does it! Gochi Sama. How much guard do we have now? Can we actually buy something? We have 167 Gari. I think that's enough to buy the uh, first power-up. Healing. But do we need healing? No. I guess this red one's our next one to clear. There's clearly more levels to this than there were in the original sushi. Oh, I must eat sushi or I'll die. Clear condition. Eat eight pieces of red clam sushi. I could really go for some red clam sushi. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Well, so those platforms just fall? Last one. Co okay, so now we can get the tornado if you want. It still weirds me out that that arrow on the cell phone. What? Sushi is not food. Sushi is not food. I can't believe this. If we don't act now, the sushi in this universe will be. Not food. Is that the guy from Squid Game? Like they all buy, they all hire the same, mostly fluent in English dude. Oh no! Sushi and some meal here is redefined as a weapon in this universe. You can't continue like this. The weapon I sushi will take your life. This is a worst case scenario. As long as you have sushi souls, I believe there's still a way to get your sushi back. The love of sushi enables the power to travel across the multiverse. Let's call this verse shift. If hope has vanished from this universe, we'll find another universe. Come, let us go together, the sushi lover. Let us travel through the many universes to restore sushi as food. Verse shifts by jumping. Sushi no Hono. <laughs> what is this music? Oh, whoops, I hit the... The not double jump in this game is launch yourself at the ground button. I should make more use of that. That makes the landing way easier. Alright, on to the next Sushi Universe. Hopefully one where Sushi is free. And, like, fish stocks are not over fished somehow. Yay! This is a different universe than where we came from. 
It seems like sushi isn't just a meal here. It's redefined in the sport in this universe. Sushi soul must exist in this universe as well, even if the concept of sushi is different. Sushi is amazing. Congrats on winning. Uh, sushi dreams on the grand stage. Eat a lot of sushi. The best, yeah, clear condition. Just eat a lot of sushi. Oh, that that poison sushi was coming after me. Okay. So does the concept of a sushi shop, or whatever that cotton candy stand was, exist in this universe? Can I still spin my gari? Yes, I can. Hey, we can stand on the basketball goal. Let's play Sushi Ping Pong! Oh, we got a Sushi Skate Park? Where's this door go? Mini game, Sushi Stacking Fights. That it? I'll pass. I, I think I can pass on that. I don't need to play the sushi stacker. Did I see that rotation with the e on Sakai? Uh, no. When's that? Let's see. Shifts. So that starts tomorrow morning, my time. All of those weapons are kind of hard to use. Huh. Like, Flingza is not that bad. But, hmm. Yeah, that rotation might be a challenge. Alright, Tornado. We should figure out how to use that. Well, we can't use it here. Bounce on the sushi ping pong table. In the mysterious universe. Oh, there's like a cannon firing bad sushi at me. Just need one more, and we're good. Gochisou-sama! That would be a bit much to ask people to type in chat every time I win a level. Kochi so sama. Skateboard sushi. Sushi skaters and the red clam. I got stuck in the bar. Oh, 
always be careful to, you know, observe your surroundings when you're in the skate park, kids. Oh, he's chasing me down. Okay, usually skaters won't try to chase you down. Unless you're being really, really annoying. Possibly jumping on, you know, the various... What do you call, like, ramps and things as a collective? Ramps and pipes and staircases. What are the various obstacles? If you're running around on them, screaming about sushi, maybe. People get annoyed at you enough that they might try to run you over. But even that's pretty unlikely. Sushi baseball! Eat and run the bases. It looks like there's three pitchers. Uh... So we gotta collect sushi that gets fired at us. Ah, now we gotta run the bases. Okay. This is a pretty simple little game that does a lot with presentation over, like, any other consideration. Do you have any more sushi... I don't see any more red portals. Ah, there they are. My shirt smells like rice vinegar. Okay. The athletic course with sneaky surprises. So, like, Mario platforming course, probably. Except it's on a... Uh... Well, that's not good. Ah, good old ragdoll physics. I hit the double jump. Okay, there we go. I've been trying to use my tornado thingy and just doesn't work. I may have spent my money on something that doesn't actually exist. I got a little robbed. Red can. Clams. Scatter on the lane. That sounds like a bowling alley, but the Tokyo Sushi Wrestling Stadium doesn't sound like a bowling alley. Whoa. Uh oh, uh... Come on. There's the last two pieces. Sushi! 
Maybe I have to buy the healing horror first, and then the tornado will work. It's not like we need the tornado anyway, though. Probably. Wayward Runner. That looks kind of like a Hell Bodies class. But it's the bowling alley again. Oh my. Need to refill up on some sushi real quick. Okay, we got it. Is there any need for you to be this delicious sushi? Just the things he screams while he runs around. Someone spent a lot of sticky notes and a lot of time just like brainstorming this clearly. Conquer the three lanes. Why isn't this issue wrestling stadium, but it has it's all bowling alleys? Stuff. Wait, there's a barrier there? That doesn't seem very fair. Is it like a maze? So we'll just save some sushi for the trip back. Uh -oh. Okay, we're, we're fine, we're fine. <laughs> Got a little launch for that one. Uh oh. Another glass wall. We gotta find more sushi or we'll die. And we found sushi and it killed us. I feel like I'm doing this section wrong. So we're gonna save a lot of sushi for the return trip. Is there any sushi out here? I don't think so. Okay. Got a little launched, but that's probably okay. Huh. He looks like he is aging from all these failures. Just 
Just duck and weave, just duck and weave. Okay, there weren't any out there. There are these two pieces here. Okay. So we gotta hope that we don't need to collect every single piece of sushi. Because otherwise we got a problem. This is our first actually difficult level, I think. I got sniped. I might need to leave this level and like try to get more. More uh, power ups. Uh, give me Gar, you not lend you a hand. No. Am I allowed to just leave the level? Exit. Okay. We'll, uh, try to go buy some that speed boost, see if it'll work. That seems to be what we need for this, the speed boost. If I can find the shop. There it is. <laughs> Nitro Sprint. Press the skill button on the ground. Oh, we need to equip the skills. So we can have one or the other. This game seems high and low quality at the same time. Yeah, like, they... They already made this game, basically. This is, like, the better version. Why can't I reach those now? Like, they've gotten very good at making this specific dumb game. We're gonna save those two sushi pieces. Alright. I the ball. 
もすぎる自覚はあるのか ?OK、ラスペお前にも脅があるだろうがさあさあ !Five more pieces! And there we go. Yeah, we just needed the, the booster. That was a definite jump in difficulty. Good thing they give us Gari for uh, losing as well as winning. These sushi train muscles are unbeatable. He's so. He's so fuzzy and low resolution. Like, it's gotta be some sort of a filter they're using here. Because you can see the weird pixels going on around our main character, too. Never been so confused by the game before. Athletic course full of dangers. At the Shibi, a big sushi dome. Well, we're trying to collect sushi souls so that we can reclaim the concept of sushi. All right, we're almost there. Do I have to push us into the goal? Yeah, there we go. Figured it out. Pro sushi soccer player right here. There's definitely a lot more to this game than there was in the original sushi. Uh, I have to eat sushi or I'll die. So I can't go into this. But I can go on top of this. Can I jump out of here? No, obviously, there's an invisible wall. Oh yeah, there's also a bunch of Earths. And they're all centered on America, which is a little bit strange for a Japanese game. But I'm pretty sure that our uh, protagonist is supposed to be American. Because all foreigners are American, right? battle against the sushi enthusiast. What if this person loves sushi? I don't know, man. If only he was talking in English, maybe I'd be able to understand it. What? He appears to be your counterpart in this universe. Are the uh, subtitles big enough for you guys to see this? Oh, I need to. I need to take the sushi throws at me. Where'd he go? I ate his fun sushi. I don't think you could really 
dub this game, but <laughs> it would definitely be a challenge to make them sound as crazy as the English or the Japanese voices. I guess I was wrong about you. You are captivated by sushi, just like me. I see your passion for sushi inside of you. I won't forget it. Let's fight for it someday. I like how the main character just like interjects constantly with NANI! Not hold on! Like they don't bother to put subtitles on him when he's like just retorting at people. Congratulations on winning. So what's our next sushi verse? And do I have to run through space again? The enemy's almost there. You need to collect sushi souls. It's like flying cars? Okay. High density vinegar rice enables high speed communication. Cars powered by sushi. How cool is that? Not very cool since I can't eat it. Sushi in the smart city. In Neo Shibuya. Do I like your little steam avatar? I'm gonna wear a mask like that on my other accounts for the Splatfest. No. I'm getting absolutely bodied here. I can't stand on these. There we go. Anyway, on my uh, non-streaming accounts, I'm gonna go with the fluffy chickens for the Splatfest, and I realize that the uh, plague mask is probably the perfect bird costume. Sneaking past security. そろそろ寿司を食べないと死ぬぜ。さあ、最高に。おい、なんでこのまたは。おい、なんでこの。うわ。At least these barriers stop the robots. Maybe not the lasers, though. Just sprint past him. Here we go. You mean it's called the bleak beak in Splatoon, and birds have beaks. So... so do squids. Squids have beaks. I liked the... You, did you see the, uh, the Splatfest introduction dialogue already? Spoilers. Uh, big man. It, big man confirms that everything except for the chickens are extinct. Wait, what are we doing here? Find red clams. Now I'll take the high road back. Sushi! 
Ooh, get another hybrid back. Yeah, we do. I like the design of this level. All right, there we go. Those are all the clams. The music in this game is actually really good, yeah. You missed the early levels where it was doing the Katamari thing, where there, there were lyrics to the songs, and they were about how sushi is delicious. You know, like how Katamari Damashi has all these weird songs with the lyrics about, you know, rolling things into wads. No, don't want to go to sports. We're done with sports. What do we got? Sushi, smart car, and red clams. So more red coins, I mean red clams levels. Oh, it's like the little cars for, uh... Mice. Have you ever seen that? They made these cars that mice could drive, where they press a panel. And it makes it so that the car turns, but if they stand in the front of the... Anyway. Mouse cars. Oh, this is gonna be a, this is gonna be trouble. You might just need to jump for it. Now we're fine. Electron prefers instrumental music anyways, unless it's a fictional squid language. Part of the idea of the fictional squid language for the music was that if you can't understand the words, then the voice becomes an instrument, too. Oh, elevator. Also, uh... You can see the little blocks that define the movement of this object. Before Red Clam Sinks. Washoi! Washoi! <laughs> This is a odd level. Oh no! We fell into the anti-sushi green gunk. I don't think that it's... I don't think it's wasabi. And it's going with your deliciousness. Oh, 
ぱすぎる理由を説明しろそしてうまっすぎるいい加減にしろうおっうますぎて困ることはないのか And last one. Oh, that lighting does not flatter him. That was a level that maybe the tornado would have helped. Ah,、uh, here we go. Just eat lots of sushi. I say, like, that's easy when the last level I got stuck on was an eat lots of sushi level. You know, just like. Uh oh, can they go upstairs? They can go upstairs! There we go. That wasn't too bad. If I, have to, if I had to put a pin in it, I would say this game is trying to look like a, a Dreamcast game. Each family needs sushi. sushi! Under a city's. Sorry, in a city under evil's rule. Have they turned the sushi into evil technology in this level? Oh, they're like cops. I mean, if I look straight up, it might be easier. Not sure exactly where I'm going. Oh, there's like. They repurposed the skateboarders. They repurposed, they repurposed the skateboarders into evil skateboard cops. I haven't had good sushi since four times. Let's see, how do I get a. Oh, here we go, spring. New sushi is compatible with red vinegar. Falling ceiling and red clam. At the Sushi Research Institute. Oh, whoa, let's go research some sushi. For a second, I thought red clams, like red coins, but technically they're pink coins. One last one. Oh, the sushi cops are on to me. I probably should have looked into how long this game is. Maze for test subjects. 
So far on these reach the goal levels, they've told me where to go. Are they gonna do that for this one too? This is... Is that where he already came from? I am not using any sort of strategy on this maze, I'm just going and hoping for the best. And we ended up at the beginning again, we're gonna... Shin does it! We go left first. There's not like an extra little corner to scooch through. That one robot just does not want to let us go. Alright, we found a way on top of the maze. Once you find your way on top of the maze, that's the end of it being a maze. Though that makes sense why I couldn't find my way out, because the way out was up. It wasn't on the ground, it was up. What a way to design a maze. Taking advantage of gamers' inability to look or think up. Charge the Nigiri Rocket Brigade! There we go. Sometimes this feels kind of like how Sonic might have evolved in a different timeline. There's one up there. And there's one way over there. Sushi, too convenient. Three, battle against Sushi Seeker. This one should be easy then, if it's like the third level we were supposed to do when we got in here. Or not. It's you. You're the guy who detected the Sushi Eater by the surveillance cameras system in Shibuya. Sushi is an algorithm for societal evolution that will eliminate bugs that threaten the future of humanity. It's time to execute the sushi function. So he shoots lines. 
I got stuck in a wall! Is there a pattern or is it just... Alright. That one took a little less thought than the sports boss. That was just a go forward and don't get hit. I see. I understand. You seem to be creating new values for sushi with your own logic. I don't understand. I apologize. Maybe our society needs your interpretation of sushi for a better future. Sushi guy agrees that their society might need his interpretation of sushi for a better future. So, what's our next generic theme? I'm gonna go with medieval, since we just did future technology. God, sushi verse. So, not medieval, religious. Different kind of weird. It seems like sushi isn't a meal here. It's redefined as a god in this universe. Hi, Bunker. In the beginning, sushi created rice and vinegar. Shibuya, the holy land for sushi believers. It's all thanks to sushi, really. 4. Deliver sushi to heaven. Like, there's an extra... I think I might draw that talking sushi. Just... We got this random church. Oh, wow. I do... I need to not die. Because that was a noise that I don't want to hear again. Oh no! He caught up with me. Oh good, it's not gonna make that noise every time I die. Okay, now I can finish this thought. So, there's definitely a lot more going on here than just like a Unity Store Asset Reflip. Asset Flip. Right? Because they went through the effort of making it look kind of like a Dreamcast game. There we go, goal! Have you already seen the little sushi shopkeeper? Because they would also be worth drawing. Let's go find the shop. Because we got our little... Shrimp, sushi, spirit. He's pretty cute. Still live, yes. Because I don't know how long this game is. Welcome to the stream. Sky dash. Dash quickly in midair. That's probably useful.
Oh yeah. Sushi in the sacred place. How is everyone? I really want to go get sushi this weekend now. Ooh, almost went up the edge. There's some sushi down here, right? Almost there. Or at least past halfway there, at least. Those flying sushi cops are just not my favorite thing. They are relentless. At least a little sushi Roomba security. You could just, you know, go up above them and they would leave you alone. Well, that wasn't good. This man loves sushi, but not Ruben's eardrums. Yeah, he's a little loud. Whatever, that makes it out easier. How did I miss that piece? I only need two more pieces. What? Does this game have a story or something? Um, some other universes are overriding our universe to make it so that sushi is no longer a food, but it's other things. And so we gotta collect sushi souls to uh, something something make it so that we can return the concept of sushi as food. Pass halfway. Where did they get time to place those? Oops. Well, this time I missed it by eight pieces. Ugh. So it has no story. Yeah, basically we're just doing the levels. Either collecting as much sushi as they require us, or collecting like eight pieces of red clam. Or just getting to the end. So far, those are the only, uh... Rule sets they've given us. 
Okay, halfway there again. Alright, we'll get these from here. And then hope they don't block our exit again. That guy got two hits on me. Where is Ruben from? He's Dutch. I thought I made references to, like, the Netherlands pretty frequently when talking to him. Alright, just setting up these little beam traps again. I got stuck in the architecture. Okay, ten more. We gotta find ten more sushi. Or I'll just get blown up in the midair. Don't patronize me, egg sushi. It has been mentioned a lot by Phil and Juice, plus it's like the first thing Ruben ever said here. So yeah, there's an occasional level that just gets suddenly way more difficult. This one wouldn't be quite as bad if it weren't for the flying cop. The flying cop is way really gets my way a lot. Maybe that'll throw him off. Nope, that didn't throw him off at all. Okay, ten more. We've got to get up here and got it. And we're still getting attacked by that flying cop. Also, I'm sure y'all have said before, and I'm just not smart, didn't hear, or he knew and just forgot. I mean, if I don't remember everything that goes on in the stream, why would you guys? Escape from the Great Fall and Sushi. We gonna do a Cherry Blossom Festival thing? What? What killed me? Okay, you can kill me through walls. Still kind of salty about Ruben's friend that didn't want to present about thermal energy. 
So this is like that silly speedrun category in Mario 64 where you run away from the one-up mushroom. Oh, that was a move. There's a scary one. Oh, the water kills me. I thought I touched it and it didn't die, so I was like, oh, wait, it's not that bad. It is that bad. Alright, so let's not do that. We can get more if we go right first. We'll get these two. Three. Nope. Okay. A little bit more. I can hear, I can hear the evil sushi behind me. Oof. There it is. It's got a little halo. That's how you know it's dead and evil. Ribbit thinks you would definitely have won if you could have talked about thermal energy and surface water. Oh well, just try to pick something easy to do then. Some have been a pretty neat level in Level Head where you have to run away from a gym because once you get close enough to one, it's like a hyper magnetized to you and exponentially speeds up to catch you if you're running away from it. There is a clear path of sushi. There was. But I went my path. I went on my journey how I wanted to do it. Also, I was creeping on my friends list, and I noticed that there is a, uh, a Switch version of Levelhead. Do they share the same levels? It's completely crossplay. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> I got stuck in the tree. Alright, where's there's the last one? Okay. And it's only like five dollars right now. I don't know, maybe I'll get it on Switch. I kind of trust my um, Switch controller more than I trust my Xbox controller. Now Ruben doesn't have Belgium chocolate, and he's going to talk about that to all the teachers present there. About your lack of Belgian chocolate? Run through the village where damnation will fall. In Fantasy Village. While we're in religion lands. Uh. 
おい嘘だろここまで不満一つがあるかスシェイうまっよしスシェイ最高にうまいぜなるほどなるほどスシェイうますぎてお客様にそうだスシェイここまでうまい必要があるなるほどなるほどなるほNow, how if Ruben had presented about thermal energy and surface water, but we have won, and so. It's kind of hard to do. Platforming. There we go. Now, how if Ruben had presented about thermal energy from surface water, we would have won, and so Ruben doesn't have food. And just it. I don't know what that last part means. He knows they're all the same lines, but they're all just screaming about sushi. Soul, sushi, soul, universe, eighty percent. Did it say something like that? Is there a percentage on here somewhere? Fly with miracle sushi. Anyway, so now I get it. Ruben doesn't have Belgian chocolate because he's not going to win this presentation thing. This is kind of hard. Kind of reminds me of the、uh, bomb smuggle tech in Breath of the Wild speedrunning. Just keep moving. Don't let the cops catch up with us. Don't get caught in the trees like a kite. Okay, we're fine. Tio is Dutch for thermish energy. Wits, something, thermal energy from surface water. Hey, we can fly now. Never mind. 
I thought if we had the god sushi, we could use it here too, but I guess not. The falling floor in Red Clam. Well, I don't think that the Dutch, any Dutch organization is going to be using thermal energy from water. You kind of need a lot of sunlight for that to be cheap. Well, I saw a piece in here. Ah, there it is. Just barely didn't get eaten by this god sushi. Can I turn off the voices? Um, maybe, but I really don't want to. I can lower them. Lower them. Ruben thinks he can use it and probably already using it. Huh. 14. Don't let the sushi chase get the best of you. In the mysterious universe. Y'all might get enough sunlight to warm, like bath water hot, but not like electrical generation hot. You need a lot of bright, direct sunlight for that to work. Like, instead of a photo... Instead of a photovoltaic uh, solar panel, places in Arizona, you know, the American Southwest, get enough direct sunlight and it's hot enough that they can just use basically a curved mirror to heat up pipes of water. And then the pipes, you know, the hot water moves through turbines and makes... Uh, you know, electricity, like so many other... Basically every kind of electricity generation basically is just... Make water move and turn a turbine. Okay. Uh oh. If you had to compare it to metal powder as an energy source for personal use, which is the final assessment, then TEO would win. Yeah, I don't know how you use metal powder for. Oh, 
Okay. I don't know anything about metal powders being used as energy sources. Well, this boss is hard. If he puts that big death field right, right on top of me, there's not really anything I can do about it. Okay. A source designed to heat industrial areas to make them climate friendlier versus a sort of wa source of water to heat homes. I mean, you can do both of those with water, though. Though our beliefs diverge, we all seek Sushi's salvation. Ah, we're all on a journey, following the same Sushi path. Let's celebrate and sing for our god, Sushi! I'm trying to think. I know there's some places where they still just use, like, hot water pipes to heat industrial and, like, home. Scheme, steam, steam, eh. stream skipped. Missed what I said. Um. Metal powder, English. I will take a look at this link real quick. And that took me away. from the... Oh, never mind. That window's... It opened a new window. Um... So iron powder can be used as fuel for large-scale transports. I have never heard of that before. It's very compact, safe, and cheaper than storage of energy via hydrogen, CO2-free, and circular. Well, iron is recyclable. Since it's an element. I will have to look into that more, but I have never heard of using iron as an energy source. Or, in this case, it looks like more of an energy storage solution. Uh, I think red is where we're going? Arm Sushi-verse. Is this where sushi is a weapon? It was only a couple of years ago I learned about wax as a kind of so, uh, energy storage vessel, too. Back to our universe. Let's restore the concept of sushi from being a weapon. Back to its original form as a dish with the power of sushi souls. Yat does it! Oh no! <laughs> they shot the sushi spirit! Sushi is not food, guy. Not He's not even holding a gun. What an ironic fate. After continuing to despise sushi, the one we face the end is... You are me. Hey, me. It's time to stop this pointless resistance. The whole universe is about to burst into sushi flames. Stop joking around. What's the point of all this? If you're me, there's no way you hate sushi. Hey, take a look at this universe. There's no way anyone here could actually like sushi. My hometown was burned by sushi. Sushi struck right through the heart of my brother. He is my only family. Sushi is the worst weapon ever. With the miraculous power received from the brink of death, I've seen the sushi of other multiverses. Foods, sports, technology, God. Even though the concepts are different, all the concepts of sushi were loved by every- in every universe. 
Worlds teeming with infinite interpretation of su sushi? Insufferable! This ends now! My goal is clear to recast sushi across all the universe as a weapon! The essence of sushi will be refuted by beings of every corner of the multiverse. Sushi, you think over what you've done and regret it! Ooh, you're the one eating sushi, right? Alright then, I'll let you eat plenty! Behold, the mighty sushi in the universe! It's time to die in the sushi! It's time to eat sushi or I will die! I'm dead. Ribbon would like to talk about how they learned about it, but then I went back to school a bit. I think I died. Like, permanently. I win! All of the universes prepare to be scorched in the inferno of sushi! It's time to get sweaty with sushi. We're getting saved by the sports sushi guy. It's time to execute the sushi function. Prepare yourself for sushi's judgment is upon you. Why? Why are you all here? After taking the maximum firepower of sushi, why aren't you dead? That's an easy one, because sushi is fun! I completely understand sushi. It's a natural outcome. Sushi is always good and can never take a human life. I believe that. That's how it is. I don't understand. What's happening? Why are you still standing? But really, sushi would taste amazing! You, the sushi lover, I have always believed in you. No, 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 no. They're sports, technology, a god, or a weapon. It doesn't matter. I'll eat all the sushi myself. It's time to get sushi back. This dev never heard not play with your food. He's not playing with it, he's eating it. Giant sushi. He loves sushi. That's what this is. It's, it's a... It's a declaration of love for sushi. Three, it's time to get my sushi back. Let's get the original concept of sushi back. Why are all the boss doors labeled three, though? People definitely leave when Ruben joins. I'll turn myself into a weapon. Then us two will become the light of hope. So we get power now by kicking people. Uh... So we convert the evil sushi into good sushi. They're kind of doing more with this concept than they really ought to be, like... For such this dumb concept of a game. Where did I get launched to? Time to eat the sushi! Okay, just smash that button like something that got cut off. 
Sushi math. Gochiso sama. Looks kind of like Captain America. <laughs> the flame tornado made for the power of four universes of sushi. He got launched like a medic with the quick fix. I don't know how you launch medics in Team Fortress. But it did look a little bit like a rocket jump. So is that me or is that Okay, no, that's that's weapon universe. Me. Sushi is the ultimate weapon, isn't it? Yeah, we use it against you. I don't care about concepts. I'm gonna eat it! Because sushi is Sushi is so good, it could reach the edge of this universe! And then he goes, no, 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 as he explodes. Because that's the kind of game this is. With a quick fix, you mirror jumps and charges. I've gotten Shibuya. Food Sushi has returned. So they didn't really translate the credits at all. But that's okay. I'm gonna assume these are like Patreon backers or something. Oh, that's the Sushi Spirit. I was like, what's following me? You could be healing a soldier and then be in the enemy team. Do you want to do that though? Wait, what's this? Are there any sushi without wasabi? Yeah, probably. Super sponsors. Some mouse. Shiyugami Garu. Isn't that a VTuber? I, I need to find more sushi. Some dog. Salon. Thank you for playing the game. Asonde kurete arigato gozaimasu. You want to jump to your death? Of course not, but soldiers just jump and launch you. Each of our perspectives on sushi differ. There must be something common in our hearts. That is... Sushi is fantastic. Well, that was a silly little game. Is that it? You've restored the original sushi concept. Story clear. Omedito gozaimasu. That's it. Now I want to just go back to the other universes. Play the levels I didn't do. But I'm not going to do that right now. Goal seen in the distance. X. Very lively today, isn't it? The mighty friend, Macho Man. Alright, I want to see this. You 
good music should not have. Like, they shouldn't have such good music. Where is the goal? Alright, that was weird. The budget went to the music and nothing else. I'm pretty sure that this was, like, there was the original I Eat Sushi or I'll Die, and that was just a straight-up budget title, and this is trying to look like a budget title. But it's also trying to look like a Dreamcast game. Like, the music definitely feels Dreamcast. Like, that era. And they're clearly using some sort of filter to make things look fuzzier. Because you can see these weird, like, artifacts around my character when I move the camera. Alright, there's a good spot to stop. So, I will be back on Monday. Next weekend we've got a Splatfest, so that'll be cool. Uh, but I'm gonna go now. So y'all have a good weekend. Get some sushi. Bye for now.